Hey guys and welcome back to more Dragon's Dogma. Yes, I'm not giving up just yet. Sorry about yesterday, we planned on streaming this exact thing yesterday, but I had huge internet problems. Um, the download was fine, it was just I had absolutely no upload speed. It was sitting there at about 12 kilobytes uh, per second. So, um, but it all sorted itself out in the morning. Um, so I guess when the company got back to work, they sorted it out. Um, so it's all fine now. I have my proper speed so we can uh, stream as usual. Uh, we're going to continue where we left off now. Um, Dragon's Dogma um, is one of those games you're going to have to get used to, to if you're used to a lot of modernized games. And it took me a little bit and I'm, I think I'm getting my... I'm getting used to it to the point where I'm actually enjoying it more, which which is uh, good because it is actually a really good game. And um, it would be a pity if I would be giving up on it uh, just yet. Now, there's a lot of features which I still don't fully understand. I don't understand how to put my teleportation stone yet fully in place. There is a way of doing it. I, I have no idea. I, I know I have a stone that I can make um, a target of a teleportation but I don't know where to place it exactly. I have it in my inventory, but it, I, I can't just use it. It has to be placed in a certain spot, I believe. And then you can kind of fast travel there with uh, usable resources, with crystals. But um, we don't have to worry too much about that. The world is pretty much alive. And I think this is what worried me in the beginning, that if you have a big world like Dragon's Dogma, and um, if you look at the map, it's actually pretty massive. And if you have a big world like that, I was worried if I have to walk everywhere, it's going to be pretty boring because there's nothing happening. You know, everything is very empty usually in these games. But in this game, there was quite a lot actually happening um, on the way. And we found this whole cave system where we had a boss fight unexpectedly. So that, that was a lot of fun. And if Dragon's Dogma 2 is designed in the same vein that... It keeps you entertained along your journey, even though you have to go on foot in a lot of things, then that's fine. You know, that's not an issue. The problem is when you have Ubisoft massive worlds and you have to travel through them and they're boring as hell. Like, that's the problem. But we seem to be doing all right. So we're going to have to go and continue our main quest, which I actually forgot what it is. <laughs> um travel to the stone of the southwest and join the forces to send the to send to the recapture hold okay so whatever that was about that's what we're gonna have to do which is a worm hunt quest uh, i believe so um let's see if we can do that we all freshened up i think let me see when we get out so um welcome to the stream sorry and also i had to delay it a little bit tonight as well um i had forgot i had to do some things and um i had to put it uh, back another hour um, so, um, Sandgraf, I hope you're doing well. You were there very early. Um, yeah, Dragon's Dogma is on sale, absolutely. Um, it's 85% or 90% uh, reduction in the moment. Um, Red Dead Redemption, yeah, that's a game I never could get into, actually, either, Jen. Uh, see, you mentioned it there earlier. Um, I never could get into that, really. Well sturdy, this place. That was oh that was yesterday's chat actually okay sorry it's just for some reason that stream has picked up on yesterday's chat. Um, tell me how are you Barry. I hope you're doing well. Kona, um, I'm doing well. Thank you. some new roads. So where do we have to actually go from here? Because I'm still trying to figure out the exact. No no yeah. So before we go up here, what we want to do is that why that's why there's a lizard on the thumbnail is um, we want to go back to the town. There is a quest actually down here that we got in the very beginning of the game, but everybody was too tough in that well. And now the, this is what it was, deep trouble, investigate the well. And below the well, we have lizards that kicked our ass because I think they're, they're, they're quite high level. So you're not meant to fight them right at the be beginning of the, the game. The in the well are weak to ice. Oh, it's awesome. Look, she has information. This is the... This is the guys that we hired. The beasts in the well are weak to ice. Okay, yeah, your friend already told me that. Um, you're just a parrot now. Okay. So they're weak to ice. Um, I don't think I have any ice spells, to be honest. But um, perhaps we'll find ore among mm, the crowds okay. that litter this place. We'll see. We'll see what we can do. There's another. Um, the on the oh. Careful! A goblin! A hobgoblin arisen. Be wary. I'll begin yeah, they the should be pretty weak. Um, there we go, nice. 
And another thing that took me a while to get used to is you don't really see where all the enemies are because you don't see all these. You see a health bar when you get close to an enemy. But until you start hitting the enemy, you don't really see a health bar. And I'm so used to just seeing everything around me from other games like World of Warcraft, you know, uh, uh, the Ubisoft games and all that, you know, that it's kind of very weird not having everything immediately highlighted and shown to you. It's, it's kind of good because it, it is more immersive and it requires more patience, but it's definitely a different way to play a game. Uh, did you figure out how to spot the main quest or do you still have to refer to the website? Um, I, I think there's a color thing to it. I'm not 100% sure. But um, yeah, if, uh, you can't spot it from the quest log. But I think when you... Um, when you look at... Um, you see the way there's a purple thing here. So I'm, I, I think it's something to do with the colors as you scroll through those quests, I think. Like these ones don't have locations. Um, I, I think purple quests are optional quests. And then you have the yellow over here. And I think the yellow is um, main quests. I'm not 100% certain, but I, but I think it's something to do with those colors, uh, if I'm not mistaken. But I would have to look at the game guide again, which is only from the main menu. So... But um, any quest that is kill X amount of X definitely has to be a side quest. That, that shouldn't be a main quest. Why is this blinking? Can I do something here? Watch on your surroundings. They hold threats and treasures alike. Okay. We share these roads with traveling peddlers, guardsmen, and other folk. It is your hometown. Is it not, Arisen? It is indeed. Best prepare well before we begin. Tis Saurians were heard in the well. Yes, the, the Saurians in the well, exactly. So if we go... Now, this is where we get... Um, how can we access our... Oh, yeah, the inn. So if I go to the inn... The inn. This is the inn, okay. I think there I can make sure if I have any ice spells, maybe, that we can switch to. Why I heard it. Guards in Grand Soren spend more time sleeping in their cups than protecting the realm. Okay. Unless the guard can keep order in a brothel or shake down an uh, This game actually, I really like the art style. Like, uh, and um, that's the one thing I was kind of a bit worried about originally when Dragon Dogma kind of uh, was shown. It looked kind of modern, but it still had very old art style to it. Um, but I think that's the charm of the game in a lot of ways. It's like if there's a new Skyrim and it would look all. Um, really extremely modern, you know, I think it would kind of nearly be wrong. It would be great if they do it in a modern engine and not their old shitty engine, you know, because it gives them more options, like even that other game, you know, from space, which whatever was Skyrim space, uh, that was really not that great in a lot of ways from certain mechanics because it was using the old engine. So it would be nice for them to move to, like, say, hypothetically, Unreal or whatever. I'm just, you know, talking now random shit. Um, and But then they should make an effort to make it intentionally look a little bit more like the original graphics, but not bad, but in a crisp, good way. Yeah. So the color palette, things like that. And I think that that's kind of what Dragon's Dogma did. I think they went kind of modern engine, but it made it look like more familiar in like the, like the first game, which is really nice. Uh, Dragon Dogma, that came out in, God, uh, 2013, is it? 2012? Yeah, I think it came out in 2012, and then uh, the Arisen DLC came out in 2013. So it came out a year after the Elder Scroll V, I believe. So, um, was it 2012? Yeah. And I don't know when the PC w version was released. I actually never knew it was just a um, that dragon comes, I'd soon attend console a release. What can I do you for? Okay, so let me... Oh, I can't do my skills here. How can I do my skills? Why does it say 8,000? Oh, that's the RC. That's not my gold. 
Yeah, managing stored items is kind of pointless right now because I was kind of trying to look at my skills. But I don't think I can fiddle around with my skills. Let's actually see if we can... Is there any better armor that we can buy? Because I have a lot of money. Um, here we go. Here's the armor smith, I think, or weapon smith. Welcome back. How fares your journey? I only wish I had more to offer. Well, let me have a look at um, some weapons here. I think I'm wielding um, daggers, isn't it? Um, I'm not sure. Is it daggers or swords? I actually I forgot. Let me just quickly here. check. Yeah, yeah. Um, what is that, a dagger? Assassins? Um, well, I suppose it shouldn't matter if it's a dagger or a knife because um, the only thing changing is the skills then. So, but I think this is, the letters is a dagger, I guess. Uh, details? Oh, here we go. Does it say it anywhere here? No, it just has a vocation. So, uh, daggers, yeah, it says simple daggers. So I suppose I could have swords. Is that the dog? Oh, come on in. Scratching my door. Go on. It's okay, come on, get up. If you're invading my privacy, you have to say hi. There you go, say hi. Ugh. You are forgiven if you think it's it was a small rabbit. <laughs> She's not much bigger than that. Um, all right, yeah, so I guess it doesn't matter as long as an assassin can use it. Um, at some point, that vocation stuff, I also still have a bit difficulty to understand fully. I know it's kind of ranking up my assassiness level, levels, but can I at some point rank up... Um, to become a strider or whatever, like a like a subclass. I think there's a subclass thing, um, unless I already did that with Assassin. I'm not sure. So let's have a look at the weapons anyway. So um, here we go. So Iron Sword. So I could have that for an Assassin. It's weaker, though. Let's see if there's anything that gives me more strength. No, and there's no, there's no better weapons here. So how do you get better weapons? You just find them? And then Hots is my, is my magic dude. So I think for him, it would be more of a case of, st of staff. But again, yeah, he has the ironclad staff in the moment anyway. So there's nothing better. So how, how do I unlock? Do I have to go to other towns and maybe those guys have upgraded weapons? I only wish mm. I had more to offer. You're always welcome here. I think the innkeeper is sitting on a chair, isn't she? That's why she looks so small. Oh my god, I am. Yep, I, I'm quite tall. <laughs> okay, so let's go underground and hope for the best. Um... I don't think we can uh, change our equipped skills on the fly. Um, I don't think so. We can only do armor and weapons. But that's pretty much it. And that stone is only if we want to change our po uh, our pawns. Some refuge I chose, eh? It is almost a blessing I was blind with fright. Okay, if you say so. Heard a low growl while I was down there. Had I seen further back? Uh, adorable Sandy, yes. Uh, she she doesn't like being alone. She's a she's a people dog. Like so, my wife just <gasps> went to pick up my daughter, and there's nobody in the house, so she comes to me. But and and I feel like oh, she loves me. But as soon as somebody else comes in the house, she's like, let me out, let me out, let me out. <laughs> I I'm only interesting when I got food. I'm the second Something favorite. This well seems. Wrong. Well, we're gonna go down and we'll see if we still get our ass kicked by the lizard people. Let's have that lantern lit. Take care it stays drier, isn't it? Yeah, that's a good idea. 
Um, another thing that I'm still having kind of a hard time figuring out if it's actually useful uh, or just really a kind of a gimmicky feature that you don't really need is the whole crafting thing. I haven't really... Um, and I don't mean crafting weapons and play and armors. I know there's blacksmiths. I, I think you can con you can interact with that can use the the resources you have to upgrade your gear. I believe I still have to figure out where they are or how it works. But in general, the crafting seems pretty useless. I mean, yes, you can make health potions. You can make certain potions, but most of the time, I just chew away, chew away on some herbs and it's fine. Like yeah, so I haven't come across the part in the game yet where I think, oh my god, I need to craft these potions. You know, otherwise I can't continue. Um, at least not in the normal difficulty that I'm playing at. So I don't know if crafting in Dragon's Dogma Two is going to be more prevalent or gets a bigger role. I have I have no idea. I hear running water from the rise. So I don't think there's a map here actually. Oh, there is. Oh, okay. So we have to go around here. So we have to go around here, and then here. But we can go into here first to check out what the story is. So this one here goes to the side room, isn't it? Yeah. This bridge is too far decayed to use. Watch your footing here, or you're right, master. I'm drenched. Is there no way down? Oh, okay. I'll take that. Anytime. Oh, nice. Okay, so we can go down here actually. And we could Yeah, let's let's go down here and see if there's anything down here. Um, yeah, I know. I know they're weak to ice. That's what uh, uh, the pawns told me. But I don't know. I I don't have an opportunity to switch my skills right now. So it's gonna have to be brute force or fire, and I just have to hopefully be high level enough. So I I don't know. I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked if they're uh, very high level. But um, if level 17 to 19 is enough, then we should be okay. Yeah, I already picked that up. That's right. So let's go back and. Or where we encountered them the first time. I'm also really enjoyed the first stream we had of Dragon's Age Origin. I couldn't believe actually how much fun I had with it. Because um, the biggest problem I thought we're going to have is that um, it's going to feel all clunky and the combat will feel old. But I was actually uh, impressed. It, it still felt really fun to play. And I, I do kind of like the combat in a way. It's fluid, but at the same time, you can pause it and tell different people to do certain attacks, you know, with ice and fire, which is obviously really good. So what is this condition we have on us now? What is this red? Can I see anywhere what that condition is? Okay, let me just Okay, make that two. Um they're still full. So it kept going out because of the water. Yeah, I don't know how to use this yet. Um I nearly skipped Dragon Age Origin because I read that you don't have to play Dragon Age Origin to understand Dragon Age 2 or um, Inquisition because they're separate stories, uh, I believe. So they don't really necessarily they don't necessarily tie into each other. Though I believe Dragon Age 2 
starts four days after Dragon Age 1, which would imply that it's kind of running in the simultaneous, simultaneous timeline. Animal carcass. I hear cries from within. Seems it's been dead for some time. What's that? I'll heal your wounds. You better take care not to meet the same end. So down here is where we got our ass kicked, I think. If we're to proceed, we've no choice but to jump. Monsters arisen! Ready yourself! Well, is that one of them? I've learned of this area. Oh, they're taking damage. So, yeah, we seem to be strong enough. So, never mind ice damage. We're able to brute force it. Okay. Oh, what happened here? I shall restore your health. Hold on. What is this on the? What is that logo? The label here. It's like a trap label or something. Oh. You see? Yeah. Now everybody is home, and you prefer them again. Yeah, exactly. Standing by the door, telling me what you want. Yeah, I see. I remember that. <laughs> its tail fell right off so um oh there's characters which appear in all three yeah it's nice if there's a bit of a connection for people who play all the games and i believe the one great thing about dragon age is that when i started playing dragon age inquisition just to see what it's about before i decided to play the first one it had the option to import a map or something and i was like what is that about and i was reading up on the forum so if you played the first game or the second game you can import a state of the world or something into the game which uh, sounds really awesome whatever that is that that is really cool oh i can see the dude okay careful oh no 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 Oh, hang on, my light is off for some reason. Let's turn it on. It's the water, that's the problem. Yeah, we're, do we're doing enough damage. Um. Oh, what are you guys feeling more familiar with? The last we'll see of their kind, yeah. Oh, nice. Act of bigotry. The last of their kind. <laughs> so, it's good to be overpowered. Like, you know, it makes things like this easier. But I still want to check out, obviously, what's down here. Yeah, games are very expensive. Uh, I looked at playing Outlast. What, what is it? Outcast, uh, New Beginning. But, like, to be fair, no matter how good the game is, yeah, that price tag is way too high for that type of game. I watched gameplay. I watched some, I watched uh, at least an hour of gameplay um, from the game. And between the cinematics, the mediocre voice acting, and uh, it is a typical THQ game. You know, it is the typical quality, which means it's fun. But it's not really the best quality, you know. But it certainly wants to charge you like it's on the equivalent line of the best quality games. And I think Outcast should not have charged more than maximum, maximum thirty four ninety nine. They like not even close to like forty, even thirty. I even would go as far as saying twenty nine ninety nine. That it, it literally is not that good of a game to justify that price tag. Absolutely this looks not. Interesting. 
especially given the simplicity of the of the game like you know that you don't have to complete anything in certain orders you just go take over a couple of camps and it's your standard ubisoft formula in a lot of ways yeah and it's just 60 dollars are you kidding me no like no way Ooh. might be able to break the bolt nice So uh, I absolutely agree. Now, Dragon's Dogma, again, I don't know really what the features are there. So I, I don't know. But again, $60 for anything these days is a bit expensive. Oh, spiders. Ah, yuck, yuck, yuck. But maybe we get some Ica or something? Uh, I don't know. Oh, the, sorry. The spider venom comes in bottles pre-packed. Okay. It's nice that the spiders already have bottled the venom. Actually, that's how spiders work. They don't bite you with a with a, with a venom sack in their in their glands or something. They 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 have little bottles that they go like that. <laughs> they actually get the venom from somewhere else. And I think we're gonna get out at the end here. Let me see. Where do we get out? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I remember that. This looks interesting. Care to find out where this path leads? Well, so what happens to the quest now? Is it automatically completed? Oh, deep trouble, new. Report back to Paul. Inform Paul. Yeah, okay, so we have to go back and talk to somebody. Because sometimes some of the quests, especially if they kill X of X, they um this encampment serves as a fine oh wow this monsters. tunnel went all the way underneath the encampment that is crazy that is crazy it is a welcome breeze i request it as a gift Maybe yeah materials here Perhaps we'll find out of use. So uh, the thing is, we have a loan in the dark coming out. Dragon Any Dogma 2. I have to wait until I get paid for my actual job, like before I can buy Dragon's Dogma 2. So I probably won't be able to buy it um, we'll on release at all. Um, so uh, I have to wait definitely for sure um, until probably next week. It depends. But uh, Alone in the Dark is coming out, Dragon's Dogma 2 is coming out, then Outcast would have been the third game. You're, you're talking like 200 euro just for a couple of games you don't even play all the way through. And I don't get enough views on YouTube Yeah, for to for each video to nearly pay for the game. Yeah, that would be worth it. It would be different if I would be getting 100,000 views per, per video, you know, that's but that's just not the way. Goblin. So I still have to spread out the purchases like everybody else. <laughs> Nice. Oh yeah. Stay numbers Leave it to me. Ooh, we got a knife? Hang on, was that actually a weapon we found here? Oh, I thought I picked up a weapon. Oh, maybe I was wrong. Yeah, that's just resources. Huh, I thought I picked up a knife. Did it not show a knife? What's that? Unless somebody else picked it up. No. Oh, okay, maybe I was uh, mis uh, mistaken. The shadows crawl with fiends. You just have to get out of thousand watchful. views. Uh, we're just having we're just having a bit of fun, and um, to be fair, I'm not I'm putting as much effort into YouTube as I probably should. Uh, if it would be my full time job, I it's definitely would. Um, yeah, we have to go down there. But um, uh, seeing it, it's more of a, a, a hobby, like you know, it's um, oh shit, I'm sorry. Sorry, I hope I don't get any bad penalties now. Don't tell the guys, otherwise I have to kill you. <laughs> Bide your time, then strike. 
but it's nice to be able to have some fun as well like you know and not the pressure of uh, oh this must make that many views this must make that many likes you know it's, it's kind of nice not even the saltiest fish it means we can wait uh, uh, stray from the path every now and then like we do with last epoch is it not arisen <laughs> the spiders by the venom from the interwebs yes exactly is that our dude we have to talk to now you've slain the monsters of the well have you yes i have Truly, you are a wonder cousin i am a wonder cousin i think upon it was my hiding in the well what brought the danger to light i take no credit mind I simply feared I'd be blamed for releasing monsters upon the village for having opened up the well. Tis a relief and all you're doing, cuz. Here, I owe you at least this much for all you've done. So what did I get? I shall strive to learn from your example. Commit myself to becoming a soldier fit to defend the land and its people. Honest. What do you mean becoming a soldier? You're literally wearing a soldier outfit with a shield and a weapon. What do you mean becoming a soldier? Okay, that's awesome. So we we've actually done the quest. That's pretty cool. So what is that this purple is quite that purple tonight. thing down there? No, 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 no. Um What's the purple marker? It's, it's not showing up here. The oh. Huh? Oh, that's just, yeah, I don't understand what the purple color is. So actually, let me save here for a second. Save and continue. And then let me go to... Um, um, save and return to title screen. So just let me go back to the main menu for a second. And because they have a, the man access to, to the manual there. And I just want to check if the what the colors exactly mean again, because I forgot. It would be nice if they could allow you to access the manual in game rather than you having to go out to the main menu but um, we'll see because they, I, i'm still confused by some of the colors so that's the modes and then minimap health gauge pawn health gauge okay that's fine oh there's a pawn message log actually all right okay it's interesting do you remember buying games where you read the manual first? I remember when I was a kid, I, I, my, my dad brought me to the stores or something like, you know, during the holidays every time and I bought the latest game of something. And on the way home, I spent literally just in the car, in peace and quiet, in the back of the car, reading the manual and just completely reading every single word, absorbing the whole manual. And especially when it was like a strategy game or something and you had to read like... 30 40 pages i was like reading through all of them you know and and then by the time you get home the evening came along and you, you had your time to go on the computer you kind of had the manual with you and there, there was something really um nice about it you know that's that's all missing now these days so anyway so we have the location destination of your current quest uh, so the yellow is just a quest destination okay so there's no main quest pointer really that's interesting. I suppose I can see that maybe from a design perspective, they thought that, um, you know, uh, we want people just to play the game, you know, and not worry about which quest is the one that gets them quickest to the um, end and stuff like that, you know. The game progression, uh, the game progresses according to quests. You can acquire rewards and experience points to claim quests are undertaken. Oh, here we go. New quest, information on a quest has information on a uh, on your priority quest which is the one you have selected um if it's the final target of a quest okay so the red purpley color uh, so the blue purpley color then okay when you're lost you do it on the quest so making a path complete look here depending on development of the story you may be kind of become unable to clear a certain quest even while you're undertaking them you can check the details yeah so there's no real you know, this is the MSQ. That's interesting. And now I read nothing in games. Yeah, uh, absolutely. I, th I think I blame World of Warcraft for it. Uh, World of Warcraft was the first game where quest text became completely irrelevant. It was just lore. So if you were interested in the lore, you could read the quest text. Otherwise, you just had a pointer and that was it. 
that plus uh, Ubisoft game designs. You this know? is a place quite restful to my kind. Oh, visit a pier at night and speak to the woman there. What is that about? Yeah, you see, there is a purple, a purple symbol on my mini map, but it's not showing up on the big map. Okay, so if we wait until night and then go to the pier, is, is that it? Is that what that purple sign is? You see, it's not on the map, which is weird. But it's showing up on the mini map, the purple um, circle. It depends how interesting the law is. Um, I find sometimes when the law gets... Like Final Fantasy, I can't keep up with the law. It just gets confusing as balls. It's... I, I just can't. So let's do this. Let's go to... Um, stay here. Why not avail yourself of the... Way I heard it. But that what can I do you and rest you and tired, till nightfall. Rest. So be it. And then go out to the pier and see what that island stuff is about. So anybody who hasn't seen this game before, the, what, what that is about is basically I decided to play online. It's a choice. I can play offline. And then I think I get some default pawn choices yeah, that it can take along. But if I go online, I can take pawns of other players, I think. Uh, otherwise, you don't get access to that, I believe. Hello. Oh. Oh, shit. What is this? Don't be scary face. Hello. Yeah, Nightingale is a game where I have to say I'm 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 feeling like I'm a very shallow gamer because I, I the graphics drive and the UI design drive me mental. I I just cannot enjoy that game. And no matter how awesome the combat would be, every time I access the menu, I'm just getting OCD oh. triggered. Oh, hi. Okay. So let's go to, um, okay, let's go over here and let's check out the woman by the pier. This looks interesting. Take care at the water's edge, master. Oh, she's pretty. I thought you she would be scary old hag. Uh, yes, I can see you. Yeah. And you are one known to the dragon, bound within the eternal ring. Sure. I have dire need of the arisen strength. Please, sir, will you lend me your aid? Sure. I might be under leveled. I have no you idea. Have we'll see. Eternal thanks. You speak now to a shadow of sorts. My flesh resides elsewhere. Okay, so you're a spirit. You're ghost. I will take you there now, if it please you. I don't know why it would please me. I don't want to look at a corpse. Hey, Clifford, how are you? Um, yeah, I thought it would be like, oh. Is that the fate you've chosen of your own will? The dark arisen. Is that the DLC? I don't want to play the DLC yet if that's the DLC. I don't know. I'm so confused. We stand now on Bitter Black Isle, far as sea from the cove we departed. I would ask you to explore its depths. Okay. Okay. Okay, I can get on board with that. They'll just delete the unsafe changes. Yeah. Were it possible, I would not send you off with so meager an explanation. 
But I fear I myself do not know it better. My past, my aims in coming here, all of it is lost, as in a fog. All I know is that I, like you, was called here, and am bound to stay. I sensed you in the distance, and called to you for help. I knew somehow, as by instinct, that you could grant the wish of the one who dwells below. Just as I know my role here is to aid you in that pursuit. I like the way you say pursuit. This seems a safe spot. Care to rest for a while? Oh! Okay, well, you know, we're fine. Um, okay. What's the worst that can happen? And um, let's save. is this hello hello now we're allergic to washing so water is bad Epitaph, perhaps. what is this crumbling letters have been etched upon it but they're indecipherable Are there? Are there though? Okay. This looks like something. Oh, there's something down there. Okay. There's a potion here. What's this dude? Okay. You're cold? You're staying by the fire, Hannah? The rift represents the bond between Pawn and Arisen. Do take full advantage. For tales of my okay, I can't even read that. This looks interesting. A demon's parapet. Let me see. That's the yeah. So a charm many believe houses the wrath of a demon. It uses it. it its use amplifies magic for a period of time. Yeah, that should be. Um, Hots should have that. Charm might consider. Yeah, I'm gonna wear this. Just I'm gonna. I haven't used one before, so I'm just gonna use it. And now I have an icon here. It's a pity it doesn't tell me what these are. It would be kind of nice. Okay. Is that a body? No. Heed these words, all who enter this place. Do not think. Just set one foot in front of the other, and by the Maker's love, keep swinging. Ah! Stupid spiders. Sufficient curatives. Does someone live here? Yes, yeah, spiders. Obviously. For what purpose was this place built? It's Bah. Also growl. Hmm. 
Oh, there's something hiding behind here, I think. Yeah. This growl was not 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 very welcoming. Can I get up there? Can I Oh there. What's up here? Another chest. Oh, rift crystal plus 400. Nice. Let's have a look about for anything useful. What is that sculpture for? It's a key. Oh. A haunting craven image infused with the sinister spirit of its creator. It's a quest item. I didn't even know we had a quest. Okay. Oh, they're actually not strong. Okay. Oh shit, they're fire! Oh crap, Apple. You see, this game doesn't have a block, I think, as such, so... No, it got me by the ball sack. Okay. okay, let me pick up all their balls. That's no mere wolf. Where is he? I said wolf. I shall restore your health. Hold on. Thank you. There we go. Gotcha. Okay, that's it. Where are you? There you are. Oh, crap. I'm desperately low of stamina. Walk ahead. Gotcha. Mother of balls, this guy is hardcore. So many. That beast looks fierce indeed. Oh shit. Ah crap. Oh no, 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 there's some hairy thing. Quick, 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 quick. I am here. Awaken. Oh, we're going to sleep. Why are we going? Oh my god, how many dots does this guy have? You're joking. No! Okay, so we're not taking this turn. Okay. Hey Krell, how are you? So this is a no-no place. We we definitely can take on the initial orcs, I guess. Let's lure them here. There's no normal goblin. Ranged attack. 
Well, it keeps them in check, which I'm perfectly happy with. Dodge! Come on, kill it! I got him. Hold on. Oh no, my stamina. One is dead. Okay. Let me go and get some healing. There we go. Nice. Okay. Leave it to me. So we can at least do the own oh, iron plate piece. Oh. Okay. Is the doggy coming back? Because one of the doggies keeps running away and then coming back. Um, oh, uh, uh, I've played this game for, I think, 18 hours now or something in total. And uh, it, it took me a while but uh, to grow on me because it's definitely different than anything I've played. But um, I do quite enjoy the game. What is this? Oh, big chest. Oh, another lift stone. So we're not going into the next big room because there's definitely death. Oh, there's the bastard. It hates fire. Yeah, it hates death as well, so let's try to work with that. Okay, so let's go and uh, go back out here and see if we can explore a little bit into different directions. Someone live here. Yeah, so this definitely looks like a door, but it doesn't seem to open. And we already checked up there. Okay. So let's get out here. So let's do a quick save and see if that is the same area where we're going to get our ass handed to us by the big skeleton thing. Or if this is still a manageable area. Pay their words no heed. Their lives all. Their black hearts will be your doom. <laughs> Fire works well. It's a wicked fast. That's no mere wolf. I'm 
I ha I'm holding it down. Kill it. Nice. Strength in numbers. Let's have a look. What do we have in there? Another demon's period, whatever that is. Yeah, I, I, it's very difficult. So, so it, it, it definitely doesn't follow an MSQ style. Like, there is no main. Well, there is main quests, but it doesn't follow the typical thing where it shows you very clearly this is the main quest, this is a side quest. Um, I guess thematically, if you look at uh, bringing the serpent's head to the town and then talking to the French lady or something again, a anything like that would be part of the main quest, I guess. But it's not extremely visually clear, but it, it, it's just, I think, I mean, it's pretty much done intentionally, obviously. So it's definitely a different way of getting used to things. Um, I'm just terrified something's going to kill us, so I keep saving. <laughs> oh, what is this? A weapon? No, just a skull. Wake stones are miraculous items that can bring your character, pawn, allies, or others back to life. Oh, treasure each wake stone for the fragments required to form them are quite rare, and each stone can only be used once. Gather enough wake stone shards, and they will automatically assemble into a complete stone. Oh, that's amazing. Nice riff fragment. Oh, that's pretty awesome. For what purpose was this place built? I don't know. What do you think, Hannah? Okay, Hannah doesn't want to talk to me. Hmm? Did you say something arisen? Y yeah, never mind. Um, okay. Um, let me see. Let's go into the next room and see if we're gonna get slaughtered again. Or maybe there's something about the statue here. There's definitely something up there. Oh, there's something behind those crates. Oh, shit. I think this is where the scary dude is. So let's just stick to ourselves here. What about here? Can we get up here? Hmm. Leave this place. You've still the time to turn back. Still the time to live. This looks like he has loot. No. Okay. Hannah is playing hard to get. Tw level 20. Ah! Yeah, I don't even know how I'm leveling up uh, uh, in the moment. Like, And um, I didn't do anything with my vocations, really. I just spent RC points on some skills, and that's about it. So I probably can enhance my character a lot more, especially with all the items I have. I just don't I know how to. Hold on. Okay, so let's have a look. So this goes down to the scary room. Yeah, okay. All right, so let's have a look and see if um, attacking them will get the scary beast summoned. Yeah, let them come to us. Oh, 
Okay. I'm cheesing it, I don't care. A hobgoblin arisen. Be wary. The ranged ones are mine. It flees. Mm, they're trying to trick us. They're hiding. Oh my god, these Ah I knew it! Gone. There, a light. Someone's left. That is a troubling foe. It's far stronger than a common goblin. Well, um, well, if we're kind of in a spot oh, where it can't reach us, then I don't mind. I'm just gonna uh, slowly kill these guys with my ranged weapon. That's absolutely fine. Oh, somebody down? Oh, hang on a second. Oh, they're in there. Why are they in there? Oh, that's terrible. And let's kill these guys here first. They're a threat when well unified. I just don't want to step in there because of the big dude. This is a formidable bow. Where's my friend? My consciousness. Eight. Mind it, Saber's Edge. I was clumsy. There you go. Kill it. I'll fill it in a single blow. I've learned of beasts. I've learned new techniques against that foe. So where... interesting. Where's the big me. guy? This is surely the door that we go back to the other room. Yeah, and this is where we came from. Oh, I didn't realize we can mine here. Where's the skeleton? I mean, he's gonna one-shot us for sure, but... Where is he? I mean, theoretically, we should be able to save here just fine. This looks incredible. Um, I, th I think it looks very good, yeah. Okay, so let's have a look over here. There are no weapons. No. No armor. I'll take that. Okay. Oh, what is up here? Money? Yes. Thank you. Oh, this is pretty cool. A 
Some of the items found in Bitter Black Isle have been cursed with powerful magic. While so blighted, their merits will not be apparent. There's someone here at the bay, name of Olra. She knows a fair bit about removing curses. Okay, so what? We picked up items now which have curses on them? There, no, they're just resources. Yeah, there we go. A bit of black like novelty. A bizarre trinket. Best, best beset, beset was a curse. Okay. What's this? Too many possessions can be more a hindrance than a help. No, hang on. There we go. Okay. We're not getting anywhere else. That was awesome. That was a nice little um, side thing. Uh, games have not evolved in the uh, really well in the last few years. Yeah, I think graphically they have evolved a lot, but I think entertainment-wise, not really. I mean, we got so used to the Ubisoft formula of games that that's actually what we consider probably subconsciously the standard of of action adventure games yeah and then every now when a game when a game comes out like elden ring or something it's like people go crazy over it because it's so uniquely different um but the difficulty level of it doesn't appeal to me but um it would be nice to have a game that is not as difficult that is kind of you know like this actually th th this game here is refreshingly different it took me a while to get used to some of the things and a lot of things that i that i found difficult to understand oh. than okay what cruel torment than to live in this place devoid of all but despair oh you sound pretty whiny if you feel a foe is beyond our means, there is no shame in fleeing. Oh no, absolutely, I get it. But um, whoever is living here is a bit, a bit of a whinge bag. They should probably get out more often. Oh shit! They live here. Oh, I, I checked all the chests so far, but they just had trinkets and stuff. Oh, what is going on here? What? There's actually a dude in here? Oh, I like a sword. Welcome, good arisen. Hmm. Three days this one. A week, perhaps. A favorite game of mine, guessing the lifespan of those who enter these halls. Nothing personal, mind. A rest easy, friend. Three score guesses here and I've yet to hit the mark once. Okay, so random. What is going on here? Who are you? Oh, hang on. Gotta pick up the herbs. Someone's looking for me. Then this pit is home to stranger folk than even I'd imagined. An honest mistake, most like. I've been down here half an age, and not once have I known anyone to come calling. Now, will you have a look? I'll see you don't regret it. Oh, we can do our skills here, nice. Um, buy and sell. Rarify? What the hell is Rarify? Oh, he's a blacksmith. Oh, can he upgrade my weapons? Oh, I forgot about that. But I have all those materials. Why can't you make my weapon stronger? Oh, do I have enough firefly stones? Oh, 
Oh, I don't have enough. Okay, I have enough actually. Ah, Hang on a second. I'll see you don't regret it. What'll it be then? I have so many items. Um Hang on. Oh, where's the There we go. Goblin horn, craft bone, small fang, putrid gold tooth, poison sack, elongated claw. There. And where's that stone? Do I have more of those stones? There. Oh, that's light cure, that's different. What'll it be then? Now, will you have a look? We need more firefly stones, but I thought. Oh, look at it. Look, 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 look. Like, I should have enough for the elongated claw. Oh, I need four. Why does it say I have one? I should have at least two. Oh, it, it did consider the items I have in my inventory already. Oh, okay. Okay, I get it. Okay, can we at least upgrade the staff? Oh, I think that's great. We can. It's awesome. Yeah, let's go for it. Let upgrade the ironclad staff from our dude. That is sweet. Um, it's a pity we can we can upgrade our bow, which I suppose it's better than nothing. Um, oh, I actually don't know what kind of gear I have. Iron helmet. Okay, iron blade. Okay, that's pretty cool. Resistance to sleep goes up by 8%. That could help. Let's do that. Okay, nothing really changed, I think. Copper ore? Yes, absolutely. That is pretty cool. And what about hots? Um, Now, will you have a look? Ah, crap. Hang on. Sorry. Hots. Mm. Now, will you have a look? I'll see you What will it be, then? What skills can I learn here with you? Advanced trigger. An advanced form of toss and trigger with a stronger upward slash that sends foes aloft. Additional button presses throw and detonate a larger store of powder. Hell yeah. Love it. Returns the user to neutral stance, learning open cosplay. Okay. Darts behind the target after parrying the attack, then slits their throat. Oh, I don't know how to parry anymore. Um, that's one thing I'm going to have to check out. That's from a full bend that requires less time to knock the arrows back. Sure. What about hearts? Nice. Let's do that. I'm gonna learn all these if I can. Um, what is this? Uh, restores. Oh, yes, that restores health at a faster rate. Nice. That is awesome. Cool. 
Core skills levitate. Okay. Kicks at the air at the height of a jump to propel the user into a second leap. Dagger skill. Okay. Uh, I don't have shields. Okay, let me see. Um... Oh, advanced trigger is already uh, uh, um, applied. Okay. Yeah, I might make more use of that. It's already applied. Okay. What about hots? Hi, Anodyne. Excellent. So he already has the better healing and um, invokes a magical citrus which clears the following from. Yeah, that's very handy, though. Yeah, we'll leave it like that. Okay. What'll it be then? What'll it be then? Um, actually, I forgot about the augments. Is there any other augment? No. Yeah, it's the only thing we have. What'll okay. It be, then? Now, we That's have interesting. Um, buy and sell. Be, Let me see what he got to buy, on especially on armor. So this is the stilettos I have, and they're actually weaker because they're not upgraded, but he doesn't seem to have any new items for me. What about armor? So I'm wearing a dress in the moment, um, which I suppose instead I could be wearing trousers and top or something, but... Okay, let's buy that stuff anyway and see. Oh, sorry. Let's go with that. Red leather cruisers. Uh, leather cape. Red leather gloves. I don't have any red leather chain. So I guess... Um, hide armor. Let's go with that. And then headpiece, red leather hood. Okay. Well, the iron helm is actually um, probably better. But so if we go here with that, we lose a, couple, a lot of defenses. But I can now also equip other things, which. Oh, this is much better. Excellent. Hmm, blink strike and burst strike. So this one, oh, that's a swordsman ring. Yeah, I don't have swords.
What'll it be then? Now, will okay. you have a look? No dying now. Well, that's the plan. If your weapons or armor have been strengthened in Wormfire, you can spend Rift Crystal to set them further improved. Oh, okay. So, anyway, um, let me just hotkey my healing potions. Um, so, it consumes health and stamina. So, let's do that. Three. And we have the herbs on two. Okay. Um, the problem with turning up the dialogue is that we'll hear Hannah and Hoth say the same thing over and over. Um, don't feel so bad. Another new game, uh, are worse. Uh, another of the new games are worse, in my opinion. I loved how easy it was to find quests in Skyrim. This doesn't exist in the newest games anymore. That is true. Um, I kind of, I have to say now, I do like sometimes how World of Warcraft does it that you have you walk through some random area and you're sure graphically you see a little icon and you go, huh, there's a quest. And you take that quest in the random area, and that leads into a chain of quests that end in some uh, uh, dungeon quest, and you uh, and you get like a, a whole separate story on what's going on about something, and it, it can trail off into this huge uh, side story that has nothing to do with the main story. And I really like that. And you get some gear which is like not the amazing gear, but it has like special a special look to it. And that was how you could obtain like a very specific transmog, for example, you know, um, which is basically you use the gear to uh, tell the transmog guy you want your gear to look like that gear, you know, that you own. And I think that's amazing, you know, that uh, World of Warcraft does that a lot, you know, uh, which is great. But uh, it did become more arcadey World of Warcraft as well at the same time. I light cure this rabbits. Give me the meat. Oh, they have carrots. <laughs> the rabbit kill. I killed the rabbit and they had carrots. Okay, can I stand near somebody and heal myself with a with a potion and it heals them? No, it doesn't. Okay. I'm kind of afraid to walk around here because that skeleton dude might come back and kill us all. See, there's a door over there. The Ward of Regret. Okay. None of it matters now. What's None of this? It. Pray, leave me to sleep in peace. Okay. What is this? A broken rift stone. Looks like you might be able to restore it by using rift crystals. Oh, sure. Absolutely. Let's do it. Why not? That is awesome. So I could, I could upgrade this my pawns here now. Using this stone as a help. Oh, they healed up! That is so cool! I didn't know it heals my pawns. Hannah, can I place you in shackles? <laughs> oh man, I should have put stuff in my inventory. I'm actually getting very overloaded. Oh, hello? Oh, these guys seem to be tanky. Holy crap. Okay, let me pin him down. Here, kill it, kill it. Oh, don't. He has my ankles. He's an ankle biter. Oh, 
stamina. Come on, I got him. Nice. Yes. We have triumphed. If they hate fire, they'll loathe this. <laughs> I love you, man. Hots is giving it loads. Nice. Come on, give us a good heal there, Hots. Leave it to me. Okay, that's great. Huh? I have no idea what I'm doing down here. I I, I don't know what this is. I have no idea. But it's awesome. Take that. Assume the enemy lurks around every corner. Well, this, this was a corner and there was nobody lurking. Let's see what we have here. Okay, this goes to the other side of the big Stenches. Oh crap! Can I kick it down? Oh, he dropped his balls. Nice. I wonder what's inside. Oh, a skeleton key. Ooh. Okay, okay. Anytime. Nice. Okay, before we continue, let's do a little save. Oh, Sangraf, how are you? Just got of work. Yeah, sorry about yesterday again. I just couldn't. Um, my upload speed was terrible. Um, I don't know why the maximum upload speed they give me is 50 megabits. And I already spoke to them and said, listen, I mean, they, you advertise yourself as an internet for content creators. Yeah, that's literally what they advertise themselves as, yeah, at this stage. And it's like, yeah, your download speed is like enormously amazing. But you do know that if you want to stream in 4K, which I don't, obviously, but just saying, you want to stream in 4K, you need more than 50 megabit upload speed. Because you would have to stream with, a, I think, YouTube. What is it? What do they recommend? If you would theoretically stream in 4K at 60 frames per second, um, they would. Um, yeah, so if you want to stream in 4K at 60 frames per second, they recommend that you uh, sit at approximately, well, the maximum bit rate that they uh, suggest is 40 megabits per second, yeah? Now, 40 megabits, yeah, in 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 OBS, in kilobits, yeah, 40 megabits um, in kilobits, it's kilobits, not kilobytes, is uh, basically 40,000 kilobits, yeah? My maximum is 50,000 kilobits that I get on upload speed which means between connecting to GeForce Now to play games, which also require upload speed yeah, at a dedicated rate, and streaming in the moment with 20,000 kilobits uh, so I can upscale it to 2K, uh, my 1080p uh, stream for good quality, um, means you're really getting close to that 50 kilobit. And yesterday I had, uh, sorry, megabit. And yesterday I had 1.2 megabit upload speed. So, and I spoke to them before and I said, listen, you can't advertise yourself as creation, content creation, blah, 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 with an upload speed of 50 megabits. That's ridiculous. You have to have at least a solid 100 megabits. Yeah, at least. Because uh, otherwise it's like really not that good. Yeah. Um. And yeah, so so what I always thought was they should give you 10% of whatever your up, your download is as upload. So as your download gets higher and higher, your upload should also get higher and higher. Yeah, because the other things as well, I, I told them, what is if I want to upload videos? You know how long it bloody takes to upload a video of good quality? It takes like over an hour. Yeah, it, it, seriously, that. it shouldn't take that long. Yeah, YouTube does allow me to go full on with upload speed. You know, giving me 50 megabits is ridiculous. 
and it's not just about me, it's about in general. If you do anything with content creation where you upload content to a website, surely you can see an argument there that you should have maybe 20% even of your download speed as upload speed, you know? It's, and I told them I pay for the highest package, you know, charge me an extra five quid and, and, and give me 50% of my download as upload. I don't care, you know, it's that's, I don't mind paying for that, you know? But um, it is what it is. Um, because, uh, I, and I said to them as well, you know, I mean, I have six, seven devices connected. My daughter watches Netflix. They do that. They watch TikTok. There is also upload on these things, yeah, because obviously you, they're continuously pulling data, which is minor. But the point is you have six, seven devices continuously update, uploading and downloading stuff. That 50 megabits is shared, you know, and it's not really um, the best thing to have at that lower rate. So, yeah. But hopefully they cop on to themselves and make it a bit higher at some point. Okay, there's a mechanism here. Okay, okay. So let's see. We, we can't fall into the water. Maybe the sword. We can pick it up. No. Oh. Flask. Oh, this is oil. Nice. Give me, give me. Yeah, I, I was twenty um, was twenty megabits per second upload. I, I you could stream at best in in at maximum about twelve kilobits, twelve thousand kilobits, which is like um, you know ten eighty p. But you all know YouTube; they re-encode, so that twelve thousand kilobits would look pretty garbage. You want to be at least on eighteen thousand kilobits, which is close to twenty you know megabits, but. Oh, this is where we came from. So if there's a mechanism, let's go across and check out that tunnel there. Unless the mechanism is in this room and I haven't seen it. Is it the chains on the wall, maybe? I can hear some noise. Oh, there's definitely something there. Hmm. Oh shit, what's happening? Oh, what? There's a troubling foe. A warrior of bone approaches. Where? Oh, we must have triggered him from from the other side. Yeah, let's skedaddle, guys. Let's skedaddle. Let's see if we Ah, not my hair, not my beautiful hair. Okay, you healing us all? Wings. Good. Okay. Let's have a look. Oh, is there mining somewhere? You're mining somewhere, Hots? I can bear to see no more death. Well, then don't kill us and just give us treasure and we're happy to go. Call me Craven if you will. I'll go no further. I grow so very tired. Let us be doubly sure to collect any spoils. <laughs> oh shit! I'll begin with the strongest. Oh shit! Are you with me? Oh, somebody res me quick. Whoa. Okay, I think we can take on the skeleton because it lost some health. It doesn't have any dots. Okay, let me see. Call me Craven if you will. I'll go no Oh crap. God damn it. No, I hold the advantage. First strike shall be mine. Okay, somebody keeps hitting me. That's terrible. Okay, I'm gonna take them. I'm gonna Oh crap. Help 
Oh, how do we parry, actually? I completely forgot how to parry. Um, because I don't have a shield, so I don't even know if parry is a thing. I can um, let me see. How did parry work in this game? Yeah, I think you need a shield if you want to be able to parry and stuff. I have a hat. I just have it set to invisible. I think there's an option where you can say not show the hat uh, um, visibly. Um, let me just see. Um, So they don't use by holding down the dagger so they may press and reach and jump button. Mm. Oh, that's a special skill, the, the forward roll, yeah. And then um how to so dodging is not really a thing. How to parry, how do you parry? Oh, you need to deflect, and then you have to... Oh, my God, they have that all in the skills, of course, yeah. So you have to equip a core skill, and then... Ah, uh, the same as forward roll. That is interesting. So you know the way we have those skills. So you have to equip a forward roll skill, which allows you then to do a dodge, basically. And... And the other skill is um, the other skill is uh, a, a, like basically a deflect skill, which then allows you to parry. So I would have to click left click control, and then left or right click to um, or E, you know. Okay, so this is tricky. Now let me see. Let me take that and see if I can bombard those guys. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, here we go. These guys are dead. We're all dead. I'll begin with the strongest. Bones! Walking bones! I cannot move! I cannot take much more. Ah, oh, bollocks! So he can't really hit you once. I, I don't think we have enough power to do, to deal with this guy because even if we kill all his ads, he one-shots us. No so the only thing I can think of is he has explosives there, so we could potentially... Let us be doubly sure to collect any spoils left after it fight. This must be the work of the darkest magic. I shall take on the strong. I'll do your wounds. The first strike shall be mine. No, they hold the advantage. It's just, yeah, he, he just one shots everybody. Yeah, there's no, there's no dodge, there's nothing, so this is really difficult. Wow. Yeah, so I think we have to retreat. I can bear to see no more death. I wonder if we can run past him, or I can run past him. And then um, escape, maybe. Human bones that move on their own. Oh, what do we have there? Escape. Escape hatch. Oh, how can we get up there? I'll begin with the oh, crap. No, what? Oh, crap. Oh, 
Oh, guys, help me attack. Okay, now this guy next. Oh, he's still alive. Oh, there's the skeleton. Let's go back. No, guys, you're on your own. Good luck. <laughs> no, 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 no. Stop it. Stop it. Let's go. Let's escape. Let's take treasure with us on the way out. No, no, no touchies. Oh, this looks like an exit. This looks like an exit. God damn it. Oh, shit. I'm out. Thank you. Oh, we lost hearts. No. Ooh, okay, that's not good. But I got I got a new weapon or something. Yeah, look at that. I got a triple tooth. A triple tooth. What a weapon. Oof, okay. What's down here? My beloved. I oh, what's that? Leave this life held in your strong arms. Oh, shit. Farewell. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. You see this dude? Wow, heavy breathing, angry dude. Boop, right in the belly. Oh my god, he has like 14 dots. Okay, let's go back. Boop, 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 boop. Um, return to the rift. So we have to... Uh, he's where we get the pawns from. Um, okay, okay. We can do this. Oh, you're in my way, Hannah. Come on, give it, give it, give it everything you got, Hannah. No touchies, we all hate those. Thanks for the two dollars, Kona. Yes, indeed. Oh, what do we got? An ogre bone? Okay. Okay, we're still gonna have to escape somehow. Oh my god. Okay. Um. This looks interesting. What is an ogre bone? Oh, it's a ring. Okay, so let me see. Ring, 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 ring. It doesn't seem to do anything. Um, definitely if this is you see so I know okay I need to skip that quest yeah so let's not go into that island yet um, but I think we um, I don't know if I can find my way Our out foes are fierce and strong. they yes, are they made a point of treating any wounds immediately well I don't know how to treat your wounds but I'm treating my wounds okay bye bye Uh, I don't know how to get out. Oh, 
Oh shit, back. Ah, oh, I have no stamina! Okay, here. Oh! Chest. That's where we started. Let me pick up everything! No! Don't kill me! No, 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 no! God damn it! I wanted to escape. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to run through, guys. We're gonna have to run through. This must be the work of the darkest magic. Oh my god, Hannah, get out of my way. Come on. That was effective. We have triumphed. Okay, I'm gonna pick up the balls. Now I'm going to save here, so hopefully we don't have to fight them again. Yeah, I have to run away. I I just have to um try to remember the way. Our foes are fierce and strong. Best we made a point of treating any wounds immediately. I think I have to run through here. Yeah, that's it. Oh, there's it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. That's it. Ah, oh, come on. Oh. Copper ore. We need that. Oh, no. I'm over encumbered. Come on. Oh, there's a chest. Ah, what do you mean I cannot carry anymore? That's not fun. Ah. Okay, what's the heaviest? I don't know. Um, well, I don't need that jar, I guess. Um. All these skulls I don't really need. Oh, okay. Ah! What the hell? Be nice, Anna, yes. <laughs> what the hell was that? Some bloody hungry hippo nonsense. Okay, okay, no more mining. I'm just gonna escape, okay? That was crazy. Our foes are fierce and strong. Best we made a point of treating any wounds immediately. Okay, I want to still see what's in this chest. Quick. Before they attack. Quick, 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 quick. Yeah, okay. Boop, 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 boop. No, no touching the chest now. Okay. This is where we... Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Yes. Let us continue our exploration using this stone as a hub. I 
<laughs> an edge that white wave skulls. Your support pawn has become forfeit. Return to a rift. Um, if a support pawn is forfeit, any items they were carrying are sent to the item storage. Okay. Um, no. Where's my um, current pawns? Like, can can I not resurrect them? Re resurrect them? Um. Blessed relief. This riftstone will mend our wounds. Well, I, I I think we need to escape somehow. I just don't know how or how how or how. Yeah. Oh man. So we have to get up. We have to go back to the dude. So this castle is like it's a whole universe in its in its own. Like it's crazy. Uh, let me put everything into item storage, actually, because I'm so overweight with stuff. This place, an outburst time could be. Now, will you have a look? What will it be then? Okay. Um. Um. You're. Cars put sauce, juice, okay. No, 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 no. Um, a stone that may spirit the user back to the gun else location if it may use Oh nice! It may be used infinitively. That is awesome. Yeah, this one we can get rid of. Um, anything that can be thrown to make noise. It, tr it treaties on magic from uh, an author long forgotten, infused with the power of thunder. Oh, we can give that to our to our magician, and he might learn something new. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure what to make of any of these items. Um, okay, what do we have here? Thunderclub, is that a new item? No, that's very weak. Found that pauldron. Um, yeah, let's put it away for now. Okay, why are we still so heavy? I guess all this stuff is pretty heavy. Okay, hots, what do you have? Um, you can give that to me. Now, will you have a look? Oh, no dying now. Okay, Hots, you're gonna have to give me... And do you sell any herbs? You've been hearing voice echoes, even the seem it's a blood. Now, will you have a look? What'll it be then? Sold out. Okay. I like oil. Oh. 
Oh, a talisman. A charm once worn by fiercely pierced individual. It uses it, its use increases the experience gained by slaying foes. For the pier oh, that's so expensive! Holy crap! That reminds me of these items in World of Warcraft that those goblins sell. Um, yeah, we don't need any of this. Okay. Wouldn't it be then? Now, will you have a look? I'll see you don't regret no dying. Okay, so now we have to run out really, really fast. <sighs> okay. Matt, dude, how are you? Hidden truth. Check all the chests in this area. Oh, yeah. Uh, if there's any chests in this area here, um, without me having to go into any other room, then yeah, absolutely. <sighs> Uh, that would make sense because I think it's safe here. So if there's any chests in here. Hmm, there's a small door. No loading screen, so that could be safe. Oh crap, that was that was a close one. Oh nice. Chest. Okay, Rift Crystal, that's that's always good. A Mage's Prepariat. Okay, so we had one chest. Mother of Testicles. One chest here. What about top here? What about up top? Nice. Okay, lifestone. We could actually sell them. If it's seen that we have an infinite lifestone now, that's actually pretty awesome. So all I need is to find um, a way to use that period stone, whatever it's, uh, however way that works. Okay. What about up there? Ah! Nice, another rift crystal. Thank you. I'll take that. There's another chest here. Oh. Oh, they're different ones for Black Isle. Okay. Yeah, that's uh, that's one of the mechanics I'm still not fully... I don't fully understand yet. Uh, I don't even know how to set my predicate stone, whatever it's called. There's definitely something there. Oh. A moonbeam gem to open it. Well, that was pretty accurate. What do we have here? Oh, no. 
Oh, I forgot I can double jump. Hang on a second. Yes. Ooh, I love it. Throw blast. Okay, no idea what that is for. tunnel another chest oh what is that a wake stone shot oh nice and the multiple of them merge into that wake stone yeah yeah yeah, yeah. absorbent rag Ooh, okay it's kind of a bit yucky Treasure, perhaps oh jesus how did you get up here a balmy incense oh, I suppose for the lonely night in Love the double jump. A pow. Okay. Detoxicating powder. Okay. Find the key, and we'll see what lies beyond. Nice. Get some more resources. Silver ore, nice. Oh, just a rock. Copper ore. So I can actually throw out all those rock stuff things. Um, if we go here, I can throw out the jug. I can throw out the skulls because that's all to throw things. Sorry. And the rocks. Where are the rocks here? Oh, 10,000 coin. Nice. It's amazing how much money we all of a sudden spent when um, we upgraded our gear. Oh, what's that on the floor, on the ground there? You have anything? No. It is not defeat to flee from battle, Master. It is survival. There's another chest here. Thanks for reminding me of picking up the chest. It was actually quite... Oh, brown leather. Oh, what is that? Oh, a light cure. I thought it was one of those be beams things, moonbeam gem. No, it's just a skull. Another skull. Is there no weapons in here? No. Oh. Surely that requires also a, yeah, a moonbeam gem. So I'm guessing the theme is here to go into one of those things and kill the the skeleton to get the moonbeam gem or go back where we came from and kill the massive skeleton, which is like super mega difficult. Okay, this is also moonbeam. Moonbeam. <laughs> Okay, I think that's it. I think that's all of the chests. And I think this might be also a mining resource? No. Um, I saw a video of this area and the guy stuck two barrels in front of those lower doors to, f to face himself inside for loot. Ah, oh, that's pretty awesome. Yeah, I try not to use glitches, like, uh, unless uh, something happens unintentionally, like, but um, that's pretty awesome. I like when games kind of have that and the developers don't fix it. Because, you know, it's all part of... Um, oh, okay, maybe. Hang on a second. 
Oh, we can't. How come I can't? Okay, now. Ah, oh, okay. Can we? Yeah, now we have to do some running. Um, um I think I destroyed all the barrels, though. <laughs> We probably have to run hots. If you lose your way, you need but consult your map. Well, consulting my map. Oh crap, there's actually a big map here. So we have to go back here. So I guess through the center of pain. The deeper we go, the keener I sense it. Malice or summit like it. Shit, there's the big boy. Oh wow, he's a different book, big boy. Hang on a second. Oh. Cyclops! Go for the eyes. No, he can't get through here. I'll do your wounds. I can't see him. I can't see his eye, but hey, you know, I don't mind doing this. There we go. Stunned with lightning. Tis disarm for now. Snatch up any tough you break free. Strike with lightning. Explode. Now attack. Let's go on to the face. The boon of lightning. Jesus, his attacks are really strong. I love it. Snatch up any tusks to break free. Oh shit. Take this foul beast. No, come on. Hit the eye with lightning before it rises. It's fallen. Now attack. I've learned new techniques against that foe. Let me go for it to, to its head. Hit the eye with lightning before it rises. I'm trying to actually get to the front. Hang on. There we go. There we go. Okay. Nice. Right in the ass. Oh, can we pick up this weapon? Oh, that would have been so awesome. This looks interesting. I know, doesn't it? Okay, let's save. Um, I have a lift stone, but um, the I don't have my um, other thing set. So you see the way I have a lift stone. So the the way I understand it is, I have a lift stone, but um, 
I didn't set my port crystal. Oh, that's for a fairy stone. So what can I do with a lift stone? Oh, okay, use. Oh, that's cool. I didn't realize that. That's really awesome. Um, I think Hannah and the others are dead, but I think there has to be a way of resurrecting them. Um, there's a rift stone here, so I'm not sure where they are, actually, to be honest. So that that's the thing. I don't know where they are. So maybe I have to hire new ones and they actually died. I'm not sure. So um pawns by level. So yeah, sure, let's do level 20. But all the pawns I want are um search conditions. I want warriors and sorcerers so let's summon lenny sebastian abel and jags okay there we go there's one of them oh there's a massive looking warrior nice yes there isn't um a few details level 20 warrior indomitable lash whirlwind slash spark slash okay spins the so there's a lot of spinning stuff i love it no secondaries but that's okay so two-hander exactly what i'm looking for he has experience in fighting everything basically saurians actually quite a lot um harpies quite a lot okay let's enlist him yeah, enter covenant. You will enter the covenant with this pawn. Proceed. Yes. I am honored to travel with you. I lost the other two. They're gone, gone. They died. Oh shit! Because he's he's in our covenant now, so he's with us now. And the other one, I want to have. Oh, let's see, Jax. Jax looks badass. I love the old man. Yes, arisen. Oh, he's only rank one though. Vocation. Oof. This is a lot of nice boons, though. Increase the duration of curative magic effects. Yes, Arisen. Yeah, let me check um, out. Oh, there's another Hana. It's a Hana. Oh, I love Fatso here. Stompy. I love it. Okay, let's see who Abel is. Um... Yes, Arisen. Okay, you have higher vocation. That's really, really good. Um, you have some resistances. Poison, really nice. Um, an advanced form of high angle that loses a great, greater number of fury projectiles that explode on contact. Nice. Uh, enhanced leaven, lightning bolts, advanced of frazzle, void fire, holy boon. Okay, yeah. Oh, look at that. You have three augments. Oh, that will come in handy. Yes, please. I am honored to travel with you. Stompy, you look amazing. I love you, but I'm I'm now filled up. Um, um, you don't. I I think it said when the when the pawns die that all the stuff they owned goes into your storage. So I don't think you lose. Yeah, it it goes it goes into your stash. Yeah, exactly. So it just saves you from um, putting it in your stash. I don't know if that only counts for your personal pawn, or also for the two that you hire. Oh, what is that? There's a statue thing here. What is this? <gasps> Porter crystal. It is a port crystal I'm about to go to bed. Have a great night, games. Kona, thank you so much for popping in and for the uh, for the another two dollars. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. And have a good this night. Interesting. 
Oh, what do you find there? What is interesting over here? No, nothing, I guess. Okay, so let's talk to the lady here because I think... Oh, there's a chest here. Has she always lived here? Seems something's written here. Um, I think we have some stuff in our storage, which I don't know if she can deal with I it. Am versed in the pure affection of cursed exactly, and I have some cursed artifacts. For now, my course is unchanged. Yes, excellent. So, um, sure. All three of them. A bizarre trinket, best at, Okay, request purification. Oh, actually, um, we also want to purify this. Okay. Oh. That was... Bi Ugh. Okay. Fiendish essence. Ugh. A jewel of summoning. A jewel of magical necromantic properties holding the power to call forth dead spirits. Oh, look at this. A virtuous ring has been purified. A ring that augments basic attributes, boosts skill stifling resistance by 25 and silence resistance by 23. That is an awesome ring. May share the same name with other items, but each one has a different attribute. Yeah, that's kind of stupid, stupid, but this one looks amazing and this one looks amazing. Okay. For now, my course is unchanged. If there okay, is so I withdraw and let's get the ring. It was a bit choose a ring. Okay. If there is aught I can do. Oh, I didn't have to. Yeah. Okay, so how come I don't see any stats change? Oh, there we go. Magic defense and... Okay. So now we have some more resistances, which is great. And... If there is all I keep forgetting that you don't have to take things out of storage. There you go. If there is all oh, what else do I have here, actually? Um... A massive amount of health. Oh, okay. These Pariats, I don't... Affects a single target boost defenses. Yeah, I could probably use that one, Angel's Pariats. And can I give those Pariats to um, my mage? Will, will he use it? Uh, I don't think he will. Oh, it made the shards made another wake stone, is it? Um, okay. If there is aught I can do, say. You see, what can we do combining things? Um, I don't think there's much I can do here. Well, there's certain things. I just don't have them. I haven't got unlocked them yet. Uh, use an item. Use an item from item storage to create something unknown. Small fangs. Sour scrag of the beast. What? I don't know. What is that? Backfat oil, okay. What about? Oh, use an item storage to create backfat oil, whatever that's used for. Wool cloth, okay. Yeah, the crafting thing, again, I'm not really sure exactly what's useful, what's not. Um... Oh, this creates a key? Oh, that's awesome. Another skeleton key created from this. That's pretty cool. And what about this? The ancient scroll. We can probably combine that with something and create some spells or something like that. If there like is all I can do, say it. For now, my course is unchanged. I shall. If okay, there is all I can change do, vocation. Say it. No, learn skills. So what happens when I get more vocations? Uh, if I level up in my vocation, does that mean I have more access to other skills that I learn? Is that it? So the these skills that I unlocked to learn, like. 
advanced trigger and all that. That was from me leveling up my vocation, is it? So if I rank up more, I get access to more disciplines. Is that, is that about right? Core skills. Forward roll. I want to try forward roll because it means I could theoretically dodge. Augments your strength, damage taken, but only at night time. But only at night time. Only at night time. Halves the severity of wounds you sustain while cheated. Augments your strength and mitigates damage, but only at night time. That is so hardcore. Okay. Fine. Only at night time is better than nothing. So let me see how I equip them now. And instead of back cake, I'm gonna. Oh, where's my forward? Where's my forward roll? I, I bought a forward roll. Where is it? It was a dagger skill. That's very strange. If there is Hang on, where's my forward roll? Oh, it wasn't a. F oh, it wasn't. It's. It was a core skill. Sorry, a core skill. So how do I activate and deflect? It's also there. So how do I activate this? Curls forward into a tumble. Effective as an evasive maneuver. How do I apply that? If there is aught I can do. If there is aught I can for now my course pray. Take care. Oh! Oh nice! <laughs> that is awesome. Now, it's a bit awkward that we have to press uh, control to get it, but it's awesome. And it doesn't cost any stamina? No way. That is so cool. I love it. Okay, let's get back to the island. This was really, really cool. This whole side trekking into this island. I shall aid for now my course is unchanged. Sir, I would take you there now. Linger in the water over long. The brine may come for you. Many boats, just as you'd expect for a fishing village. <laughs> I mean, it costs no stamina. My new way of traveling, baby. Are your travel preparations complete? Way up, doubtless. But what can I do you for? You seem tired. So be it. That is awesome. That that was really really awesome. This side trekking into this uh, island. I really enjoyed that. I know we couldn't kill any of the monsters. Well, we, we killed the, 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 the ugly eye, single eye dude. Oh, coffee is cold now. Ugh. Which is awesome. So let's head out and try to find our way to the
So I like Dragon's Dogma 2 is coming out. So if I, if if they have it on GeForce now, I don't I, I don't think I can play it with my GTX 1080 to be honest. Um that voice is very scary, scary, creepy that you have there, but okay. Um, so I don't think we can play it on the GTX 1080. So if it's not coming to GeForce now, then I'm not sure if we're going to be able to play it. Um, I'm, I, I am still in the middle of saving up for the new PC. And I actually posted uh, um, the PC that I'm currently looking at um, on my Discord. It's um, it's basically the, fort, the i9 14... 900k i think um which is um because i'm not going to buy another one for at least 10 years and um, the only debate i have with myself is will i continue saving That's until i can afford the 4090 or will i be okay with the i have to wait until may anyway until the first of the fifth until the 4080 super is becoming available um because i want the 4080 super um, at least, but changing notes. that to a 4090 um, would be a difference of uh, $900, sorry, 900 euro approximately, which I, I don't have an issue with. I just have to save a little bit longer. Yeah. But the other thing I'm debating is, should I get 64 gigabyte of 6000 megahertz RAM? I don't know what their CLN is or whatever it's called. Or should I go with um, 96 gigabyte of 5,600 megahertz RAM? I definitely want shit ton of RAM because, like I said, I'm not going to upgrade this PC for a long time, but uh, I want to use it for rendering. I might go back to making videos instead of just streaming, so I want to have very fast rendering times, which means high CUDA cores on the GPU, of course, and um, loads and loads and loads and loads of RAM. Yeah, so someone hired HOTS on the last stream. Did they? I don't remember that. Oh, that's right. We looked at HOTS and um, I think it was either me, well, someone hired me as a pawn, or someone hired HOTS. That's right. So I think we have to go up here. So let's select that quest. Oh, level 50 minimum. That makes a lot of sense because the, the, the big monsters... They can one-shot us, and I suppose you need that amount of health to absorb the hits and to heal through it. Yeah, absolutely. So we have to keep going here. So if we look at it on the map, why does it tell us to get out of this exit? That's what I don't understand, because if we get out of this exit, yeah, um, if we get out of this exit, where's the road? Like... Is it not the path passage here? I don't know. I thought that is where the passage is. So if we okay, let's just follow it. So if I if I go out here, yeah. How is it expecting me to get to the other side? Well sturdy this place. So it's showing us to go here, but there is no actual path from here to there. So we have to go around. Yeah, we have to. There's no other way. As a consequence, the Grants' sea routes have been ill-developed. I love that I can run. Yeah. And then this roll to get my energy back. <laughs> Look at that. That is awesome. Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, they already. <laughs> what the hell is that? Fire works well. Okay, that was awesome. She was like mid and ninja style. Fire 
works well. Fireworks well. Uh, this is actually awesome because uh, that is part of the whole pawn pawn system that I really love. Is that they, the more you fight a monster, the more they learn the weaknesses and strengths of that monster. So when they say things like, "Oh, it's weak to fire," it's not only that they point it out; they actually start using fire skills against that mob because they learned that that is a weakness of the mob. I think that is really awesome. Okay, here we have the high roller coming down. We're apt to meet bandit thieves as often as Kevin's master. Be watchful. Okay, it's we have to step aside here. Hang on. Yeah, just let it pass. Wolves hunt in packs. Leave it to me. Guys, can you come? Certainly. On my way. Very well. Very well. You sound like you have been slowmatized. Come on. Okay, whoever is down there, you're on your own. Oh, now there. Just skimmed it back. So I'm assuming we have to go down here and then we can hopefully kind of go up there somehow. I, I really don't know any other way. Any time. I have it. Hurry. Oh, what? 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 Where? Oh, crap. Bloody hell! That was a waste of time. Oh, more shackles that we can make keys from? Yes, please. So, how am I? I still don't know how to get there because. I shall restore your health. We have to go over there, but that's not where that road is going. Unless, is it all the way up there and we have to go from here? Well, it could be, theoretically, that we have to go from here all the way down. Well, we don't know until we know, I guess. But can we kind of go across the mountain towards that direction? Let's see. <laughs> No, we can't actually go up there. Okay. Forest rocks are all coated thick in moss. Keep an eye out for them. Look, Risen. A rope. Seems suspicious. There we go one down. Oh shit, there's a lot. Oh, there's a trap. Don't trigger it. Can we? Oh, 
Okay, that was actually not bad. That was a good amount of experience. Ready yourself. Okay, I got it. Finish it off. Come on. There we go. Nice. Goblins roam in packs for this. Okay. I'll heal your wounds. The growling is insane. Uh, let's see, there's something on top of the stone here. Where the girls are green and the grass is filthy, yeah. Uh... Oh, hey you. Okay, finish it off. Oh, I love how much damage it does when you hold it down. It's amazing. We have triumphed. Okay, let's go this way. Beasts dwell in water. Best we remain cautious. I sense monsters all around. If we enter the forest, go ready for battle. Those scales and spears are an unwelcome combination. Oh, here we go. Slay them one by one. Here we go. Finish it off. The first strike shall be mine. We're not doing any damage to this thing. Okay, let me get the Saurian. We have to get the tail first, I think. Let's be rid of the serpent first. There we go, got your ass, snake. Nice. Let's go for the face. Oh, can you kill that Saurian nonsense? God damn it. Wakey, wakey. I've learned a new way 
Okay, I'm out of stamina. Aim for the head. Awaken. Strike at it with magic. Okay, let me see. Is there any um yeah? Ah, oh, god damn it. Don't let fear keep you back. Don't let hold your punch. Sir, what do you propose? I shall be. Hold on. Awaken. Shit. Cleaning the floor with my body. Oh my god, every time I just about get up, he's been an asshole to me. Okay, are you quite done now being an asset? Trying to aim for the head. God damn it. You're such an asshole. Oh, yes. Let's go. He's nearly dead. Oh, quick, quick, quick. I got you. I got you. Oh no, we got more Sauron's. Um. Yes, yes. Nice. Come on, let's pick up pick everything. Let's pick up everything. Freakish main. Yes, okay. Oh, wow. I have no idea what's going on. There is so much going on in this forest. This is crazy. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Ride him, Sebastian. That was a waste of time. Like, what the hell? Every two meters there's something like... Sebastian is a beast. I hold something down and Sebastian is like nearly one-shotting. That's amazing. Okay, can we now get a move on to where we have to go? Thank you. I wasted one ward stone, whatever it is, but I think we just fought so hard against the creature. It was nearly dead. It would have been silly to restart the whole fight. The fiends are swift. Be wary. The wood grows thicker. 
Okay, how about we just ignore everything? It will be done. On my way. Very well. Uh, no, we don't need light. Um Oh my god, put it away. Fit to hide all manner of evil. Stay ready. Brothers Graham in the forest, yeah. <laughs> okay, this is gonna definitely roll down, is it? Oh, there's a big boy Cyclops there, which we're gonna have. I've learned of beasts. Oh, nice iron plate. That's to upgrade weapons. There's simple prey once hobbled. the big boy fighting let's do a save here just in case what quest are we on you know i i keep losing track um we are on a fortress busy. we did the under the well quest so all these quests are side quests yeah except this one is one of the main quests i believe which is the worm hunt quest that we got in the city in the north uh, to do and that's where we're trying to go to which is kind of here so, but let's fight this big boy here. Let's go for the eyeball, I guess. Oh, he has a helmet. Can we destroy the helmet? Look at Sebastian go. Okay, I'm going to... Oh, you little bastard. I love the way the blind works, like, uh, if that is blind, like, where you can barely see anything, that is awesome. So you guys focus on the big boy, I take away the trash here. So let's see if I can climb up, I'm not even sure where I am. Can we get its helmet? Can we get rid of its helmet? I'm at its helmet. Take its helmet off. Come on. I can't see anything. Oh, there we go. We can finally see. Let me see if I take this that will replenish some stamina. This will stamina. Very good. And this is good for stamina. Nice. I, w I still think we can hopefully take off the helmet here and break it somehow. How can I climb up and stab him in the eye? Oh. 
Keep attacking. Okay. We don't have a choice. We're gonna have to attack it in the legs, I guess. You see, all the other armor comes off if we hit it, yeah? But his face armor, for some reason, didn't come off. Come on. I'm still at the helmet. Hopefully it's gonna come off eventually. Is there any more stamina stuff I can suck up? Um Why are you fighting debris over there? He's nearly dead. That was good. And we completed the quest. That's awesome. This looks interesting. I shall restore your health. Hold on. My kind grows better able to serve the more we learn. Yeah, I mean, that's good. What's that? Um... Okay, so now I'm having to put give, give some stuff to Hots because I'm getting overburdened. Um, what? We can use a rag? What for? Oh, to soak up oil. So if you get oil spilled on you before you combust, you can wipe it off? That's pretty cool. Okay, good. Excellent. It's safe. Yeah, I definitely want to save after this fight. Oh. Okay, so I think we're nearly there. Oh, shit.
What the hell is that? How strong is it? <sighs> Probably was a bad idea. Not doing any damage. Ha! One shot. Ha! 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 Oh, it has an oh, it has a heart. Ooh, it has a weak point on the heart. It has a weak point on the heart. I'm, I wonder how much damage that can do. I know we can't beat it, obviously. Yeah, but let's see how much damage we can do to it on the heart. Far different divine from Capitan. Perhaps it dares noble fruit. Using this should help. Please help me. Oh, there I can see it. Much more. Bring it nowhere while it's aloft. Uh, well, if I could, how, how come I can't aim straight up? That is so stupid. That is actually stupid that you can't aim straight up. I cannot move. Like, there's no reason to do that as a mechanic that you can't aim straight up. Find I'll scale it and strike from above! No, they hold the advantage! Some beasts still remain. I've learned a new way to fight their ill. Come on, where's the heart? Anyway, it doesn't matter. I, I was clumsy. Some beasts still remain. <laughs> On my way. Certainly. Find the tail. Attack the head to create Over. an opening. Oh, I think we did a little damage. Can you see the little, tiny little gray area? Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, I don't care if I if I fail the quest. There we go, I think we're there. So hopefully everybody resurrects but when we get back in here. Abel, Hots, oh, where's Sebastian? Damn it. Shall your health. Hold on. Sebastian. He's gone. Is he out here? We're here. It is known as the Shadow Fort, built to ward against a okay. goblin invasion. Yeah, ah, what a pity. Uh, it just did a save, so um, oh, that's interesting. So yeah, maybe from up top we could have come as well. But this this is good, like going over the mountain, going across here. 
I wonder what the proper path path would have been if we would have gone from here to around here or something. But um, anyway, we made it to our actual target. Now, we sadly only have the two mages. We don't have Sebastian, which means I'm not really sure how we're going to survive this. Unless um, in here somewhere we can find a one of those stones. But the soldiers are there, so I wonder if there's a rest area where we can hire some. These guys are friendly. They're the, yeah, they're friendly. Judging from his fine armor, that man is likely to be the captain. <laughs> Judging from his fine armor. It will be easier going searching this area now. Oh, it's a pity we don't have a, you know, stone here. Because I'm sure even if you get here, whichever other way you get here, surely you're going to be damaged and you need to rest and you need to replenish. So it's funny there's no spot here to do that. Anyway, we figure that out next time. I'm going to leave this one here for tonight. Um, we might, I don't know, if, if Dragon's Dogma 2 comes out uh, and on, G on GeForce Now and I can actually play it, then the next stream might be just Dragon's Dogma 2. But if I don't have it yet, we're going to do another stream of this continuing with that quest here and then we're going to um go to uh go to dragon's dogma 2 oh so how sorry how do you how do you port, how do you drop a port crystal that's what i don't understand yeah because Hang on a second. So when I, I have port crystal, yeah, but when I do that and use it, it's sad. It can't be used. So how does this work? We're here. It is known as the shadow fort. So if I go here now and I click on this. Built toward against oh, now it worked. <gasps> oh, okay. So, Eternal Ferris on a stone that may spirit the user back to Grand Soren, else the location of a pot crystal in an instance. It may use in. Yeah. So, can I now. Oh, this is awesome! So, will I be able? Will that stay there forever? What this port stone now. Those stones hold. It's a port crystal master. So, if I use this now again, can I go to? <gasps> yes. So, bit of like. Oh, yes, yes, yes. So the stones become. So each town has a built-in port crystal, like uh, uh, like built-in as in there is a circle of port crystals, um, like we have here, which I can go to. And the other ones is the port crystal I manually place, and they will forever be there. That is amazing. That was the only one I had. I found it somewhere in a, in a thing. So that means we can go in here now and um, replenish ourselves, rest... Um, oh, this is amazing. A smithy, I we might do some side quests as well, but the point is now I forever can fast travel to where we had to go. That is amazing. And and uh, it would be awesome if you can pick up the port crystal if you don't need it anymore there and then can place it somewhere else. Um, but I don't know if you can reuse a port crystal like that, obviously. Oh, this is awesome. That, I'm really happy that we figured this out during this stream, to be honest. Um, that is amazing. I'm really happy that we figured it out because that was one of the things that really confused me, the way the game explained it last time, because I tried to use it and I couldn't use it because I wasn't out in the open world. But um, this is awesome. Anyway, I'm going to leave this here. 
I very much enjoy this game. And um, yeah, rest and rehire Sebastian. Um, if he's there, I don't know. Oh, hello, dude. We might can hire him. <laughs> hello. He's level 24. Yes, there isn't. He would cost... Uh, what is he? He is Adonis. I love the way he's called Adonis. He's a strider. No, I, I wouldn't um, get another strider in... Well, maybe. I don't know. Handel's Kiskol Splitter Instant Reset. He seems to be pretty good. Um, anyway, we're going to do that next time. We're going to leave this here. Thank you so much for uh, joining the stream. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you could leave a like on the way out, that would be appreciated. And um, subscribe if you want to see more of those contents. We play in different type of games, sometimes simulation games, the supermarket simulator. We're going to have another stream of that. So I'm not sticking to a specific theme. Uh, we just do what we have fun with and, um, you know, go from there. So, but anyway, thank you so much. Um, I see you guys tomorrow. And until then, have a good night and stay safe. Bye-bye. Thank you.